Good evening. Welcome to Back to School Night. We ask that you please keep your mic muted during and after the presentation. Please direct any questions to the chat box where Ms. Murray, Mrs. Trope, and I will answer questions. Here are your third grade teachers. Mrs. Trope teaches reading, Ms. Murray teaches math, Ms. Cunliffe teaches writing, science, and social studies. Ms. Taylor is also a third grade teacher. What will your children be learning this year? We'll start with reading class with Mrs. Trope. Mrs. Trope's whole group lessons are aligned with the New Jersey Common Core State Standards. Mrs. Trope uses a program called ERLA, which is the Independent Reading Leveled Assessment and is an independent reading program that helps students select just right text and work on goals to continue advancing levels. During ERLA, students meet with Mrs. Trope to address goals and complete activities in a one-on-one -on -one setting. Mrs. Trope covers a variety of texts during class. Her fiction texts address the New Jersey student learning standards. Nonfiction texts address cross-curricular topics like social studies and historical events, biographies to identify notable people, and a variety of science topics. Students have a variety of programs available to support reading at home. Parents can help by encouraging 20 minutes of independent reading each day for their child. Books should be on that student's level so they can continue to build on and practice skills they're working on in class. Students also have access to Epic, which is available during school hours. Mrs. Trope has posted online libraries in Google Classroom, which are available to students. They also have access to Study Island to practice skills. Newzella and ReadWorks both require Mrs. Trope to assign texts. Students will also be using ExactPath, which is a personalized learning app that fills gaps and propels learning forward so that students below on and above grade level receive just what they need. Here's a picture of Mrs. Trope's classroom. Ms. Cunliffe. In writing, we cover a variety of topics. Foundations is our phonics program. Level 3 reviews previous skills and builds on them. It focuses mostly on multisyllabic words and suffixes. There are three units of writing in third grade. Narrative writing is what we start the year off with. It covers personal narratives and short stories and focuses on using descriptive language and building stamina. Our second unit focuses on expository writing, which is research-based informative writing. The third unit is persuasive writing. In this unit, we focus on literary analysis and other forms of persuasive writing. We cover a variety of topics in science and social studies. In science, we discuss forces and interactions, life cycles, ecosystems, and evolution, heredity, and weather. Our social studies topics include maps and geography, American government, and the history of New Jersey. During writing, science, and social studies, we'll also be working on typing, which is a critical skill, especially this year. All assigned work in writing, science, and social studies should be completed during the class period. There will be no homework assigned. Here's a picture of my classroom. In math, Ms. Murray uses a math fact program. Every student begins on the same operation and moves up at their own pace. Her whole group lessons are aligned with the New Jersey student learning standards. Major content includes multiplication, division, problem solving, and fractions. During remote learning, Ms. Murray asks that students' cell phones are put aside for less distractions during lessons. Assignments should be completed during the class period. 
Calculators cannot be used to complete assignments. However, using scrap paper or dry erase boards is encouraged. Here's a photo of Miss Murray's classroom. Here's some other information. If students are attending in-person lessons, we ask that they have a sweater or hoodie with them daily, as temperatures can be very cool in the classrooms when the HVAC is running. You'll see two different grades on report cards, a numerical grade and a standards-based grade. The numerical grades are as follows. An A is a 90 to 100, a B is an 80 to an 89, a C is a 70 to a 79, a D is a 60 to a 69, and an F is 59 and below. You'll also see scale scores, where four represents exceeding grade level standards. A three is meeting grade level standards. A two is developing proficiency on grade level standards. A one is not yet meeting grade level standards. And NA means that the skill has not been assessed. Please know that in the beginning of the year, we expect students to be scaling a one or two in most skills. But as the year progresses, they'll build competency to achieve a three or four. To help your child succeed in third grade, you can ensure they finish weekly goals, such as tonight's 20 and math fact sheets. Contact the teacher or teachers if you have a question or concern. Build confidence that your child will achieve the standards with effort, practice, and a positive attitude. Here's our contact information. The fastest way to get into contact with us is by using Class Dojo. But please be aware that we may not be able to respond immediately if we're teaching. You can also contact us by email or you can contact the main office and leave a message. If you have any questions, please feel free to leave them in the chat box and we'll address them. If you have time, please fill out this parent questionnaire that will tell us more about your child and how they approach learning. Thank you.